So I bought this camera off of eBay and let's uh, take a look, see what's inside, shall we? I actually know what's inside, but uh, I'm not going to say and we'll keep everybody in suspense for a few more moments. All right, some padding. And here's the camera. Is there anything else in it? Nope, nothing else in the box. So let's just put that off to the side. This is the, let's look this up real quick. I was hoping for a way to actually uh, um, know how to pronounce this correctly, Oop. but not today. This is the Mamaya, Mamiya, Mamiya NC1000 uh, single lens reflex camera. I'm going to, as soon as I figure out more, I'll tell you more about it. This looks to be, this looks to be a manual, an all manual camera, but I haven't looked through the viewfinder. There's, that obviously is a battery check. Not sure what kind of battery it takes. Something, um, something big, maybe a couple button cells. Take a quick look. Ooh, wow, those are exhausted. <laughs> you know how you can tell those are exhausted? Look how much they're um, bulging it on each end. Let's see if I have a couple. Yes, as a matter of fact, I do have a couple of these. You can tell these are 357 slash S76 slash, well, that would be it, because these aren't lithium. All right, the plus side will go up. So we'll put two in here. And all right, now the light goes on. See the battery light goes on? Always a good sign. Good. All right. That's pretty much the unboxing video. Um, at some point I'll tell you more about this camera. Obviously it's going to need some work. I wonder if there's any film in here. Nope. This is always the uh, traditional way of opening the camera back. Same here. These seals are... In... As you can see, those seals are in pretty rough shape. So I'm going to have to replace those. That's not a big deal. Let me remove the lens. There it is. There's two buttons here. Don't know what this one is for yet. Oh, it's a depth of field preview. Yeah, that's a depth of field preview lever. See the lens stop down, and this is your lens release. This uses some type of bayonet. I'm going to guess it's. I'm going to guess that it's proprietary. Those are a bit rough. Viewfinder is not bad. Doesn't have too much dust or debris, surprisingly. And uh, aperture is running down the left side. So, interesting. Shutter speed and aperture all in the same thing. Oh, this is an automatic. You know how I can tell it's an automatic? It's because the uh, aperture uh, dial locks right there. Now, how do you... Oh, you know how you get it off? You actually press that red, that little orange dot. And you can set your aperture automatically. The style's a bit sticky. I'm going to guess from the size, you know, very similar in size, real quickly, real similar in size to the, uh, this is real similar in size to the Kodak, uh, Kodak, to the Canon AE-1, 
slightly shorter, so I'm going to guess that this was made in the 70s, 1970s. Single throw um, film advance. That is a that is a um, manual self timer. Yep, lens is a 1.7, 50 millimeter, pretty standard for that time. Ooh, focuses actually pretty smoothly too. So you look at that, I can focus with one hand. Definitely soiled. Some stuff going on in the back here. Definitely soiled. Um, you know what? We're going to restore this camera. I may or may not restore this uh, in a video. If I restore it in a video, I think it'll be fun to watch. There's some loss of paint around the front of the uh, lens here. There's loss of paint around the front of the lens, but overall not bad. Okay, no instruction booklet. I don't think I need one. Uh, it's a pretty straightforward camera. Once again, <laughs> you have two uh, flash synchronization posts. You have your battery uh, thing on the bottom. No provision for a um, for a film um, film advance uh, a, a, fil a film winder or motor drive, and uh, this is made by Amaya Camera Company Limited. Uh, and in the meantime, I will learn how to pronounce uh, Mamaya, whether it's Mamaya, Mamiya. I will when I get back with the next video. I'll have learned how to pronounce it. That's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see any cameras uh, featured in a future uh, segment, please let me know in the comments below. And keep on taking photos.